Hey, what's going on, folks? It's your boy EA. Uh, just sitting here, man. I was watch actually watching the game earlier between uh, the Celtics and the Miami Heat. Um, you know, great game, double double overtime game. Uh, but one of the big things about the game uh, that kept on coming to my mind is that you know Rajon Rondo just got hurt. Uh, they got him with a torn ACL, and I was thinking about how is that going to impact the Celtics season. You know, can they still make the playoffs? And anybody who watches uh, NBA basketball knows Rajon Rondo is definitely, you know, the top playmaking point guard in the league. Uh, I mean, you got Chris Paul out there and you got Darren Williams, uh, you know, a fade and Steve Nash and Russell Westbrook. But when it comes to getting assists, uh, Rajon Rondo is the man, man. Just simply, simply put, he, he is the best pure point, you know, traditional point guard in the league. Uh, and a big part of the reason for the Boston Celtics success. So uh, I was sitting and I was thinking, you know, with the Celtics already struggling, they're battling. I think right now, currently they're in the eighth eighth playoff spot. Uh, are, can they hold on, being that it's just halfway through the season, and and actually make it into the playoffs? Uh, we know we got the Philadelphia 76ers. I think that's the closest team behind them. But uh, it's going to be tough playing without a point guard. I know uh, they got like Courtney Lee and they got uh, Jason Terry and, and Barbosa. But uh, I'm sure most people will agree that Rajon Rondo is the is the, the has taken over the reins as the leader of this team and, and, and just, you know, the guy on this team. So just something I, 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 I brought up. Me personally, I think they're still going to make it to the playoffs. Um I think they got a great coach in Doc Rivers, uh, who definitely knows how to get the most out of his guys. You got uh, Paul Pierce and Kevin Garnett, just two old school proven veterans, just you know old school dogs out there on the court, and uh, you know they aren't gonna let anybody on the team get complacent. I think they they step things up on the defensive end, and I I just think you know just coming down the stretch, Paul Pierce is gonna do more. Uh, play more of that, that old man game that he has. You know, it doesn't really look good, but it's effective, uh, you know, and and just try to make it into the playoffs. Their best bet, I think, though, is to try to fight and work to get to like a seventh seed or hopefully a sixth seed uh, so that they can avoid playing, you know, a, a, a Miami or a New York in that first round. So, uh it's going to be a tough road for the guys. Uh, I know what the great coaching that they got with Doc Rivers and just the, the team culture they have in Boston. I just think they're going to be able to the, the, the hold it out. I think they're going to be able to pull through and uh, and, and actually make it to the playoffs despite uh, Ray John Rondo's end, uh, injuries. So, uh, Rondo, we, we you know we hope you a speedy recovery. I did hear in a in, in a post game interview, Doc Rivers was saying. Uh, you know, we found out that it was an ACL tear, and we're going to try to get him to the same doctors that Adrian Peterson uh, of the Minnesota Vikings had. Uh, and, and when you look at the the kind of season that uh, Adrian Peterson had coming off of that ACL tear within nine months, uh, he didn't skip a beat as far as uh, when he was able to come back. He started in training camp and was able to, you know, lead the league in rushing this year. It, that's a phenomenal story in its own. And Doc Rivers was just referencing how – Rondo is going to be seeing that same doctor that Adrian Peterson had and how he hopes to get the same effects where Rondo will be ready to start off next season and, and you know, just be ready to go and be ready to play. So just wanted to share with you uh, my opinions on, on the recent uh, situation with Ray John Rondo with the ACL tear. And, uh, you know, just ask the question, do you think the, the Celtics are still going to make the playoffs? Um, you know, so... You know, leave me a comment actually in this blog post. Uh, let me know your opinions. Let me know how you feel about uh, the Celtics and Rajon Rondo and, and how the how the season is going to turn out. Um, also, if you know if you're interested in learning how you can you know write blog posts about the things that you love, like basketball is one of my favorite sports and and just a hobby as a watcher. Uh, if you want to share information about those things and learn how you can make money for it at the same time, then there's going to be a link that's going to be posted below this video. Uh, click on that link and, uh, you know, we can show you how to do that as well as be able to share your favorite hobbies and, and, and just things that you like to do. So once again, this is your boy EA Evan Anderson out of Savannah, Georgia. Uh, 
Yo, let me know what you think about the Celtics and Rondo. Peace.